I can't imagine having a set of dentures that I can't eat with. Well, let me tell you, I want to help that. I want to change that. I want to do something. Do you have dentures that just don't fit you? They never fit you. You can't eat or you know somebody like that. In the United States, there is a profession called denturist. In the United States, also, denturists are only legislated to practice in seven states. Only seven states, and those states are Maine, Arizona, Idaho, Montana, Washington, Oregon, and Colorado. However, however, in Australia, the United Kingdom, and Canada recognize the denturist profession. And here in the United States, we don't. These men and women that are denturists, they're artists. They're artists of their craft. They want to make dentures. They want to make a beautiful smile. There's colleges in the United States for this. Why isn't a denturist allowed to practice? The National Denturist Association has been seeking a reversal of the federal labor statistics denial of a separate standard occupation classification for dentures. The BLS has denied denturist a separate classification using the argument that the sample size for dentures is too low in most states for them to collect and report any data. Well, let me tell you, I want to help that. I want to change that. I want to do something. I can't imagine having a set of dentures that I can't eat with. And I know a lot of you out there are like this. When you go get your dentures made, you go to the dentist instead of having the dentist say, all right, you need dentures. All right, you're going to go to this office now, which is a denturist. He's going to take care of you. You're going to talk to him face to face. There's not going to be any lab notes coming back and forth from the dentist to the lab. That's not going to happen. You get to talk to him face to face. And right now, I know most of us have to do that. We go to the dentist, we sit in the chair, and the dentist does the measuring and everything, and then he takes some notes, and then it's sent to the lab, and the lab sends it, sends it back. Well, at that lab, is not a denturist. It's not a practicing denturist. Or if it is a denturist at the lab, the lab tech, he's not getting the accreditation that he earned in a bachelor's degree or a, a three-year degree. Because these men and women that are artists, they they learn. They learn all about the mouth. They do everything, but they don't do tooth removal. They don't they don't do anything like a dentist would do. A denturist, in my opinion, I would want to go to a denturist. I would want to say, hey, here I am. Let's make me a smile. Can you help me? And this man or woman is going to know how to do it. They've learned the craft. They've learned the art. They've studied smile. They've studied muscles in your face. They've studied, they even work with implants. They don't put the implant in there, but they work with the teeth that go on top the implant. So why is our state and federal government blocking us from having a dentist? Why? Why? When they're all around the world, you can go to a dentist's office. Can you imagine going to your dentist and even having a dentist and a dentist working together in one office? Can you imagine going to your dentist and saying, okay, here's, your, here's our dentist. You're going to work with him now. How nice would that be? It would take the back and forth away from the lab going, it, it, this is just frustrating. This is just frustrating to me. It's very frustrating. I have a plan and, and I need your help. I, I'm going to... I just need, I need your help. And why am I doing this? This lady right here that I'm showing you, that is my grandmother. And she, next to my mother, is one of the imp most important women that was ever in my life. My grandmother wore dentures from a young age and I never once, never once saw my grandmother eat something without pain. We would go out to dinner and my grandmother would get soup and we would get steak. That's the way my grandmother lived. She lived in pain every day. Since I've started my YouTube channel, I've gotten ugh, thousands at this point, emails and messages from you that you're going through the same thing that my grandmother did. So here's what, here's what I want to do. I've made a Gmail account. And what I want you to do is email me your story. In the subject line, I want you to put the state and then I want you to email me your story. The email for that is simple. I want a denturist. I want a denturist. What I'm going to do with these emails, legally by law, I have to tell you. I'm not going to sell them. I'm not going to spam you. I'm going to save these emails because one day I might need them. 
one day somebody else might need them to fight for a denturist in your state. I know the power of social media is big and I ask any influencer on any platform that is watching this to also make a video. Hashtag I want a denturist. Have your people email that email so I could save their story too. Because it's not fair that we don't have a choice. If we needed brain surgery, would we go to our medical doctor? No, we wouldn't do that. I know that men and women in our legislation, they don't even know that denturists exist. Well, I want to make a change. I want to make a difference. I want them to know. I want them to know what it is because more and more people in the United States now are getting dentures. And shouldn't we be able to ask who we want to go to? I mean, if the option is there for me to go to a denturist, I'm going to go to the denturist. From my dentist's advice, shouldn't that be a thing? I think that should be a thing. Now, I, I'm not by any far means done making videos like this. I, I'm not done. And I ask that you subscribe because if you want to learn more about this, subscribe because I'm going to go into what a denturist does. Maybe have a denturist on. We're going to learn. We're going to learn. We're going to get the information out there, but I need your help. I, I need your help to make this work. I have a TikTok. I'm not very good at short form content. So if you make short form content, form can't even say it see if you make short form content on facebook youtube tiktok anything help me out hashtag i want a denturist that's all it is email me let's get something started let's help these denturists work let's help these denturists help us because that's what they want to do. In my top description, you'll see it. All you have to do is click on that and you can email me. All right, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.